Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Final Fantasy VI. We are just outside Figaro Castle, and we have gotten Ald back into the party. So we uh, no longer are running with a half-strength party, it's just a three-quarters strength party. Anyway, let's go ahead and uh, actually talk to people in uh, the castle. Uh, I did meet the dropper enemy. It can only be met inside the engine room, which is why I wasn't meeting it before. Hold on. Uh, actually, before we do that... Hey, how you doing? I know someone who deserves to be locked up in here. Uh, let's actually put Ald in the lead. I don't think you're... No. I'm not gonna say anything different. Has magic really made a comeback? So, were you guys trapped in this room for a year or something? Magicite gives humans magical powers? Amazing! We'll come check out the side rooms, uh, in a bit. I want to check out the shops first. Hey, Chancellor! Welcome back, King Ald! Huh? Zappa, what a splendid young man you've become! Make yourselves at home here! I can't take money from the king, even though the world has gone to hell and I haven't been able to sell anything for a year. Look, don't you have a family? Just shut up and take it. So we can still buy things for a half price, which is uh, pretty nice. You don't have any special items there, though. Still, half price for all of that stuff is pretty good. And, uh, he says the same thing. And, uh... We now have access to the Debilitator. Casts weak point randomly, used with tool commands. I genuinely do not remember what that does. I genuinely didn't remember uh, Air Slash either, or whatever it's called. Um, I only remember one more past the ones that he has. I remember the, uh, the, the, the Mantra one, uh, which heals, but... Uh, I, I used it off-screen, and boy, did it not heal much. <laughs> really, really did not heal much. No more Returners, no more Empire. Now who am I going to side with? Oh, I don't know, maybe Figaro? Just a, a wild guess. I mean, you could, you could embrace your home country? Sure, just an idea. I mean, Figaro seems to be in pretty good shape comparatively. Uh, not yet. Though Ald showers his attentions on women, most are too smart to pay any attention to him. Ah, King Ald! I'm pretty sure I've said that before. Several of the castle's citizens left to join the cult of Kefka. If a loved one should call out to a cult member's name... Should call out a cult member's name, however. Hmm. Okay, so that's, uh, that sounds like a clue. King Ald, welcome back! Even the Chocobos have survived. Zappa, every bit an adult now. I remember that time so vividly. I was so angry. I learned something important on that day. I want to marry the king! Kefka's one shy of a six-pack. You mean he has five-pack abs? Ooh, that sounds like a serious medical condition. You should probably see a doctor about that. No, no, no. Yeah, you guys are saying basically the same thing. All right. Can't rest there. All right, got to rest in the uh, the inn room. Weapons and items manufactured here are sent to South Figaro. Are, are they though? I mean, you know, it's it's been a year and you were stuck under the, uh, the sand. Maybe they didn't strike that. Uh, um, maybe they haven't been stuck for a full year. Maybe that's what it is. I don't know, but I like the coincidence of 
you know, Ashley getting to town just as Zappa is holding up a building, getting to South Figaro just as Ald is, uh, um, you know, being sneaky with the, uh, the thieves. It's all very convenient, isn't it? So I think I've uh, met most of the enemies around here. So let's go ahead and get this thing moving. Let's go to Kalinga. Whoa, boy, man. I like how the uh, the castle is back to the uh, um, proper world of balance color. There used to be mountains there. You would think that we would be, uh, you know, going through flooded section, but... I don't know. Next stop, Kuringen, watch your step. Watch your step, huh? Is this part of Figaro's land or, or not? Oh, hi, monsters. How's it going? Sand horses and Malagas. I didn't counter these things off camera. Let's go with ice. Uh, let's try the... De oh, Debilitator just works on one. Well, let's try it. Ow. Yeah, get dead. Ten experience points! Oh, goody. Uh, you are on Zone Seek? Yes, you are on Zone Seek. Good. We got, uh... A forest here. Moose! Pep up! Hey! Pep up! Okay. Well, that's... It seems... <laughs> you haven't taken any damage, but I'm gonna kill myself and heal you! Oh my. Um... Bioblaster? Yes, go ahead and pep up. Hmm. Well, lightning worked. Bio is not going to work. That's probably going to heal it. Nope, just zero. All right. Uh, let's go with flash. Yeah, flash works. Actually gained a level. Okay, yeah. You've learned everything. Um... You guys are a little ways off, so it's not a big deal. Hmm, what's this over here? Deep Eyes and Moose. Alright, well, we've already kind of verified that these things don't take much damage from much of anything. You don't gunk. Yuck. Disgusting. Dreamland. Good, you can block Dreamland, apparently. Go ahead and flash him. Flash him works pretty well. I don't know if it has a specific elemental type. I could look these things up, but I'm lazy. And it really doesn't matter that much. I'm sure that's going to have no bearing on uh, anything in the future at all. Every time I hear Kalingan, I think of Valingan Graveyard. 
Those beautiful days will never return. Oh god, no, no, not a flashback, no! Oh, look at all the birdies. You know what? I think I always thought that these were rocks, but I, I think they're just like dead flowers. Huh. Hey, are you a Narsh guard? Narsh is filled with monsters. I don't have any place to go home to. You are. Let's not go in there just yet, actually. There's real men. There's a real mean guy fighting at the Coliseum. Seems he's looking for a weapon called the Striker. You want to equip some party members? Uh, those not now in your party, sure. There's still some people with vision, even in this world. Like my brother up north. A handsome man with a quaint way of talking visited our village recently. He kept saying vow to everyone. Eagle Claw? Could that be? No, no, it's, it's probably... Probably Solar. General Store. Hi, can I help you? Uh, I mean, I guess you can, but not right now. Hi, can I help you? Yeah, we got all that stuff. We can buy darts, we can buy dice, we can buy Trump. Let's, let's not buy Trump. Randomly dispatches an enemy. Dice say nothing. Enhancer and gold lance. Hmm, I wonder who we might be getting soon. I... I wonder. After all, he must be searching the world over for that fabled treasure. Find the treasure and you'll find Laftal. Wouldn't that assume that he'd already found it? I mean, if I find it and I haven't found him, then I suppose he would find me. I, I appreciate that uh, all of our people, rather than searching for each other and getting the band back together and fighting Kefka, they're all off doing their own thing. It's like, well, the world went to hell. We got separated from everyone. I guess I'll just go do whatever the heck I want rather than look for all my friends. We planted some seeds, but nothing's growing. Well, that's because you're not watering it, little girl. It's as if the plants have lost their will to live. I suppose that could be it. Hmm. That doesn't look like there's anyone here to talk to. <coughs> this world's already on the heap. Hope. Hey! Kyolux! You're alive? Come along with us, we're after Kefka. I don't know if I have it in me anymore. What are you saying? I'm just a gambler. I want to be left alone in my average home. I mean, I mean, this world is too chaotic for me. What's worse, I've lost my wings. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, the gambler says that the world is too chaotic for him. Before the world collapsed, you fought with all your heart. You were absolutely fearless. You know, in the relatively few times that you actually got used. That was then. We could never have that world back. Um, I mean, we kinda can if we, uh, you know, fix whatever is causing all the, uh, crappiness here. You want to live in this world as it is? No? Then do something about it. Get out there and protest before the government. Or whatever. Make sure you vote. That sort of thing. <laughs> Alright, you win. I'm starting to feel lucky. 
Thanks, I needed that. Now, let's go to Daryl's tomb. What, is there an SR-71 Blackbird in there? Uh... We're gonna get us another one. Airship, that is! Wait, why haven't you done this before? Gasp! That place we went actually is relevant to the story? I don't believe it. But wait, let's rest. 200 gold pieces per night. Need a rest? Sure. Nope. I like the nope. Okay. Mm Not sure if his equipment works best from the back row. Um. All right. So the dice. Yeah. Let's actually take a quick look. At his stuff. That ah, er, ah. empty. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. it's not down there. Uh, also, let's do that. I think there's one more tool, but I don't remember what it is right now. We'll get it eventually. Alright, uh, so we've got uh, cards, darts, trump, and dice. Cards, 104. Darts, 115. Trump, 133, but uh, randomly dispatches an enemy, so it randomly instantly kills. It's not actually going to be all that great coming up. Uh, and uh, the dice are... Huh? And you can see that if we equip the dice, battle power goes from 28 to a 19. Yeah, we wanna we wanna go with uh, darts for now. We'll go with uh, optimum, but just get the darts on there. Uh, diamond shield is fine. So other than those, all he can use are mithril knives and dirks. Um. I think I'll get the Bard's hat on just for that increased uh, um, block percentage. Ninja gear. Nah, that's fine. Relics. Okay. I got enough money, so uh, let's make it rain. Just because we can. Uh, and... Don't know if there's anything that makes his uh, slots better. So, well, actually, that wouldn't work with coin toss right now, anyway. So, uh, I think that you can have the sprint shoes. And so, the sprint shoes on you. You can have the white cape. There we go. Holy cow! M block of 49. That's uh, that's pretty good. See how close you are to going up a level. Not very close at all. Pretty sure I did get you everything, so let's double check. Yep, so I just need to wait for uh, you to finish up with Fenrir. Which will be done pretty soon. Can we leave the town, please? Thank you. Oh, a one step. They were just waiting here for me. Harpy Eye! Oh, that is a big bird. Let's make it rain! It's pretty good damage. Zappa learned haste. 
Now, interesting uh, note, uh, I, I did see that at level 32, Ashley would have learned some spells, but we already got them from some of the uh, espers, so it's uh, not really a big deal. Carbuncle, what's left? Warp. Do we get warp from anything else? Yes, that. Okay. Let's get Dispel. Need to keep an eye on uh, experience that we gain. Let's head to the north first. Deep Eye and Moose. See if GP rain works on on this thing. Don't gunk. Ew. Yuck. Yeah. I do like that flash works on them. Yeah, with four party members, we're really not getting that much in the way of experience points anymore, which is perfectly fine. Bogey. All learned X zone. There we go. Let's get Bismarck on you for now. And you can have a Fenrir. There we go. I don't know how I forgot to uh, get Zappa with everything, but oh well. More bogeys. Bad doggies. Bad doggies. Make it rain again. Oh, that's actually not very much. <laughs> that was uh, kind of overkill. How are we doing on cash anyway? Thir 347,000. Yeah. The precious the item wagered, the better your prize will be. This is Dragon's Deck Coliseum. Champions from all over the world come here to fight for prizes. What? Look at me, I'm a receptionist. <laughs> now you better watch what you bet, or Master Chupon will just come and take it from you. You ain't wrong. Battles of the Coliseum are one on one. I'm an Imperial Trooper. Probably the last of them. I have some valuable info for you. Talk to the Emperor twice. Use this when you found the place where the Emperor hid a secret treasure. Hmm. Interesting. Hello. Someone's been pretending to be me. Don't be fooled. Artros is your receptionist? He couldn't pay his debt, so I put him to work. I figure he'll be here for about another 100 years. Good riddance. Creatures from all over the world come here to compete. Get a load of the crowds! Get a load of the crowds! Alright, well, I'm not gonna do this yet, but, uh. No. Uh, explanation, please. Care to fight in the Coliseum? We fight for items, etc. here. First, choose the thing you want to wager. Next, your opponent will appear. Choose someone from your party to fight this opponent. A one-on-one -on -one auto battle will then take place. The item you wagered covers your participation fee. If you win, you'll be rewarded with an even better item. That's all there is to it. Well, actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and do one. I've got some spare items. Um... I think if we wager something that's pretty awful, we won't get anything great. But let's go with an Ape. Uh, great. So, Chupon, when, when Chupon shows up, um, A, 
the results would be an elixir, but Chupon is just going to sneeze you out, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, but Zappa, go ahead. And fights are automatic. Well, that's just fantastic. So there's really nothing, you, you can't, you have no control over the fight. Oh, well, he didn't actually sne sneeze us. So I, I have lost the Epe. Yep. But that's one reason why I uh, wagered that. Um, it's not random. So if you have... Um, I mean, you can beat Chupon, I believe. But it's not easy. And all you get is an elixir anyway, so it doesn't matter. I say about the best healing item in the game. I mean, who uses elixirs? No one uses elixirs. Another Harpy Eye. Is it just me, or does it have, like, uh, um, like jewelry on it? Yeah, weak to wind. It's pretty nice. So, uh, in general, I don't think I'm strong enough to get a lot of the good stuff there. Um, but it is how you get some of the really, really good stuff in the game. That's some pretty good damage there. Jeez. Not expecting it to be so high. Getting two magic points from, uh, that enemy, though. Which is pretty nice. I mean, there's plenty of trees around, really. More bogeys! Oh, it must have been, uh, something... Because that, maybe because uh, um, that that weapon may work uh, against flying enemies. Anyway, uh, this is where Kylux told us to go. So when we come back next time, we'll head into Daryl's tomb. Poor kid. <laughs>